Sharon <laughs> says, not I, not you, Sharon. Not me, not me. Different Sharon. Uh, hi, I'm new to Teams. Yeah, it's definitely not Sharon. Our Sharon. <laughs> I'm new to Teams and have set a couple of teams and channels for my employer, some with up to 40 members. I would like to, uh, internal employees and external group members, so not employees, to receive a notification outside of Teams when something is added in the chat area, maybe via email. The external people do not want Teams running all day or check the sites each day. I have uh, done it so far through Power Automate and want to know if this is the best way of doing it or is there another way? You can do it through Power Automate, but Power Automate is definitely overkill. Yeah, I mean, you've got the uh, you've got the notification set up for internally. Um, yeah. I'm not an expert on what uh, you get as external guests for notifications. Ex external guests don't get the email notifications and email like the internal people do. The thing that I would be most concerned about using the Power Automate is the cycles that you're using, right? Mm -hmm. Um, because if that channel gets a lot of interaction, you could be like definitely burning through, like to the point it stops working halfway through the month because you used all the cycles, right? And then it doesn't pick up until the next month. Yeah. Yeah, that's what Sharon needs to be aware of the consumption model. Mm -hmm. <laughs> there, is... there really was no good way to do this um, prior. And so we would recommend that people like log into the browser into Teams and that it specifically says here they don't want to keep Teams running all day. Um, so the biggest recommendation I can make around Teams is to um, use the new version of Teams because the new version of Teams will allow you to basically get notifications through Windows for every single team that you are a guest in as well as your home tenant. Mm -hmm. um, and so that actually is like one of my favorite parts of the new version of Teams is that you actually get notifications across all tenants no matter what. So the other thing that I do is, so I have different profiles in my browser for the different clients and I have some that say, hey Stace, I need, you know, I send something here, I need you to respond because now you, you can do, turn on the notifications in Teams in that profile and it will actually pop up on that window. It's not that I have to go to that Teams or look at it, it just notifies me that someone messaged me over there. And, you know, I don't have to switch my actual Teams for my internal or anything. I just pop up that profile and then I, then I, you know, uh, minimize it. And if I happen to get a message during the day, I still see the notification. To me, that's a better model. And if you want to know how to do that, I'm going to drop a link in here for you, Christian, of the blog post that I wrote that specifically tells you how to do that. Wow. Go, oh, Sharon. Look at that. The, the one last thing I was going to say, uh, again, is, uh, is that you can have the browser version of that Teams environment and just open in the background, just leave a tab open, because I'm sure, like all of us, there's already 100 tabs open. Um, across multiple browsers, um, but uh, I know, uh, but you can have that open. And the nice thing is that you will see the little notifications up at the top as well that, Hey, there's messages, there's things that are happening across yeah. these other environments. So it, it's, yeah, the new version of teams I'm a fan of, even though it's slightly broken for me. <laughs> it's almost it, ready, Christian. It's almost ready. Yeah. Where oh, for those you know, like it, uh, so I have three environments where I have, where I am a full member, not a guest. And then I have dozens of guest memberships. Mm -hmm. um, and it, the new teams used to work and then it stopped working and kicked out my primary. And so now I can get into two of my three tenants through the new teams, but I have to go to classic or to the browser version to get to my primary. I had the opposite problem happen yesterday. T1 kicked me out of my primary. Mm -hmm. So it's funny that we just had this conversation. I just had three pop-ups from three different tenants that I've got connected and minimized. And <laughs> great, you guys jinxed me. Next question. <laughs> <laughs> but it is it, the new team's experience is, is better anyway. Yeah, I'm in so. it right now. Yep, I'm I, a fan still, of it. I'm not. Still, I'm in the browser. I still wish I could put my teams in alphabetical order. It would make it so much easier to find things. Just drag and drop, Stacy. A, B, C, D. Just put them in the right place. Then they're in alphabetical order. I have way too many. That just, no. yeah. you, you didn't say automatically. You just said you want to be able to do it. I gave you a solution. You know what? <laughs> <laughs> it's been a while, Sharon. Been a while. She has spoken. <laughs> I have spoken. This is the way. This is, it is a way. Yeah. It's some way. It's long and prosper. Yeah. It's the only way.
Nanu, nanu. <laughs> and they wonder why we're sure to say this. <laughs> Christian, this is what you get for doing this on a Friday afternoon. That's yeah. Right. What's the what's the opposite there? There's the live long and prosper. There, there's the die fast and suffer. <laughs> it, no, isn't it like this? So this live long and prosper. It's something like this or or this way. There's uh, there's the other one which is the, That's the negative. Great. Thing. It's, That's I, I think it's a I legit think you thing. turn your hand around and <laughs> <laughs> and then drop a few figures. <laughs> I think it's no. except one. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. Sorry. <laughs> All right. Uh, 51. No, but I think that's a legit, I think in the Star Trek, I'm not as Trekkie, but like, but I think that's a legitimate thing. It's like the, the die fast and suffer. There's like, I don't know if that's it, but there's like a negative thing and just slightly adjusted. I need to, fi- I'm finding this and I'm making a meme of it. Like, I, I so, so, I so need to go on my list. Because I'm sitting here thinking about them battling, and instead of saying something, they just stick up some fingers, and I know they're supposed to die and suffer. <laughs> yeah. We just watched Galaxy like, Quest the other day, and I'm trying to think of what their oh, thing was. Yeah. So good. <laughs> so good. I just mentioned that this morning. It's it's a it's an important film. It's important. <laughs> it's it's played multiple times throughout the year in my house. Foundational. Household. Foundational. Yep. yep. That mystery man. Be professional, people. What's that? Yeah. <laughs> You're just gonna make me laugh more. Stop it. Yeah. <laughs>